when I say I'm in love, I'm in love. I just absolutely love it. You can see the back. All you need is a little bag, a little dress, and you're literally just good to go. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. So today's video is going to be a huge pretty little thing haul. I'm just so excited. We've got clothes, we've got loungewear, we've got pyjamas, we've got self-care bits. We've literally just gone in on pretty little thing and I'm just, I'm just way so excited. So I've got gin. The gin is accompanying us this evening. It says gin o'clock so I can't really argue with it. It's actually a Friday afternoon when I'm filming this and I just thought, you know what, let's have a drink together, have your coffee, have a little drink, whichever you fancy and we can just have a chill together, talk through all my favourite clothes and just have a little chat, you know, that is the vibe of today's video. So if you're new here, I would absolutely love for you to stick around and you would join my little family, that would honestly mean so much. We have a lot of hauls over here, so if you like clothes, then I mean we're soul sisters already. So definitely stick around and subscribe and then let's just get on. Let's get the rambling out of the way and let's just get on with the videos. So let's have a little sip of our gin. First thing I'm actually wearing, am I ever not wearing my favourite thing at the start of the haul? If you've watched my channel for a while, you'll know. The answer is no, I'm always wearing my favourite piece. So first piece is this little brown dress. If anybody knows my obsession with chocolate brown, I feel like Instagram is just going crazy for chocolate brown. And I'm just here for it. I love it. It's such a nice colour. I feel like as well, it kind of just goes really nicely with my hair. I feel like anybody can rock a chocolate brown, you know? I just feel like it's the colour of the season. So yeah, this dress has a little collar. It is a mini dress. I am going to just put an overlay clip of the full length of the dress. It's ribbed. It's so soft and sorry just paired with like just paired with like a little brown bag this bag is from boohoo by the way it just looks perfect like all you need is a little bag a little dress and you're literally just good to go so that is the first item so on to the next piece which i am just so excited about my friend sophie would absolutely love this we just have like a little bit of a mutual blazer obsession so i'm gonna just show you it so here she is wow can you actually believe how beautiful it's like it's not really like a, it's like a light chocolate brown you know it's kind of like a kind of like a caramel you know i absolutely love this i got this in a size medium because i really wanted this to be long enough to wear kind of as a dress it's clearly not a dress but you know what i mean to be long enough to wear on its own i just think this is so cool and it was not expensive at all i'm not gonna lie it isn't the like it isn't obviously leather it is a tiny bit plasticky but just for the look i thought like this is perfect so i'm just gonna put it on for you i'm just gonna give you all the vibes in one Oh, I just love it. I absolutely love it. So here she is on. I have just like a single breasted blazer. Is that what you call them? That is not what you call them. I just look absolutely silly right now. But that is kind of the vibe I'm going for. It has pockets, which we all know I love a pocket over here on this channel. If something doesn't have a pocket, like it is kind of a no from me. Do you know what I mean? Like it isn't. Where are you supposed to put your hands? That's what I don't get. So it does have pockets. It passes that test. It has two little buttons. I mean, would I wear it done up? No, I probably wouldn't wear it done up, but okay, I have tilted the camera down a little bit, so hopefully you'll be able to see it in its full glory. I just absolutely love it. It's kind of like mid-thigh length. I feel like everything I ever describe, I'm like, it's kind of like mid-thigh length, but that is just, it just seems to be the length of everything. It's got its pockets, it's got two little buttons. Oh, I just absolutely love it. You can see the back. Do a little full 360 for you. I'm in love. I actually am in love. So these trousers let's just have a word about these trousers because i just i just feel like i'm in love with these as well this is when i this is what i mean like when the haul arrived i was literally blown away and pretty little thing if you're watching you've smashed it definitely not watching but i'm just i'm just manifesting those vibes out into the universe that i will one day collab with pretty little thing that'd be an absolute dream anyway less of the dreams let's just get on with the trousers so I've been looking for some wide leg trousers for a while and if you follow me over on Instagram, every single Tuesday I do like a Tuesday this or that. So I put on a poll like checks or prints because I kind of, I kind of haven't decided. I'm still going to like venture into both but I think prints won but I just still love checks so bad. Like this picture of Georgia May and her sister, honestly just it just really inspired me to get something checked in my wardrobe. So these are the trousers I picked up. They're kind of like a very neutral brown and cream pattern. They're like full length and they just go out. They're not flared. They're literally kind of just like wide leg and straight, which I love. But these are a size 10. And I would definitely recommend sizing up in these because these are still quite tight, even though they are a 10. So I'm going to put these on. I'm actually going to style these with this dress as a top. 
and I'll insert a picture on screen of me doing that because I just think this top looks so good with them. I'm not gonna lie, because the dress is quite short, you can kind of get away with it. Like you can kind of just tuck it up, trousers on, and you've created two full outfits with two pieces. So, I mean, if you're looking for some neutral staples to make a few outfits, mix and match them, I'd recommend these two because they're my new two faves in my wardrobe. So these are the trousers. I mean, I'm gonna insert an overlay again. I'm gonna try actually. Oh, no, we're not going to be able to do it. It's not going to happen, is it, really? I'm just going to get my gin and talk you through them. I mean, when I say I'm in love, I'm in love. Like, look at the overlay clip. Like, you'll see them in their full glory. They're kind of just, like, floaty to the floor. Honestly, unreal. I am about five, four, five, five in height, and they are... I would say they're like a little tiny bit long for me with no shoes on, but obviously I'm not going to be walking around with no shoes on. Um, with like Air Force or something like that, they are like just about the right height, but I would say if you're a bit smaller, they could be a little bit too long for you because they are on the long side. But I don't know, maybe they'll do them in the petite section. I'll definitely check and link them down below for you if they do. But yeah, I just love them. I think they're so good. This is what they look like at the back. They're just kind of normal at the back. I've just been making a TikTok to this song. Okay, let's stop. I'm gonna hate myself. I wanted to do these things. I edit back and I think, what? Like genuinely, what are you doing? And I just, I just don't have an answer. I just honestly just think, who knows what you're doing? Weird. Anyway, let's continue with the haul. This clip that I have on my hand today actually is from Pretty Little Things Well. See the clip? I don't know if you can see it, but it's just one of those like, little. Are they called like crocodile clips? I think they are. I just love them, so yeah, that is the clip as well, I'll link that down below because honestly, all I've worn in my hair since the haul arrived, bit of an obsession, I need to get some more of those clips, anyway. Next up, I'm going to move on to the slightly spring outfit in case you get a bit bored of the browns and the neutrals. I am so excited for the spring colours to come in and I've kind of paired my own little cord here, which I am in love with. So this is the sweatshirt, I got this in a size extra large because I just like my sweatshirts to be honestly huge. The bigger the better, if it's oversized, I'll take it, add to my basket, so that's what I did. It just says, pretty little thing, 2012. I just thought it was really cool, it's the fluffy material inside, and I will be getting so much wear out of this. So I picked that up, and then I kind of paired it with these joggers, because I thought a green jogger would kind of tie in with the pretty little thing. The pretty little thing joggers are my go-to. If you're looking for some, like, comfy, cosy joggers that are just better than anywhere else, Pretty Little Thing is your girl to go to. So these are the joggers. They just have like a darker, pretty little thing right in here. They're super oversized. They have a cuffed hem at the bottom. Chef's kiss, honestly. Absolutely love. So I'm going to put this outfit on and kind of show you the little co vibe I was imagining because I'm so excited. Oh, wow. I just love it. I'm trying to give you like a shocked reaction. Like, wow. Because that's how I felt when I opened it. I feel like I prefer when I do hauls for a, full like a first impression so I can be like... You know, but I'm not going to pretend I've just tried this on. Look at this styling. I mean, the colours. I'm impressed with myself. I love this. Hopefully you love this. I just think it's so cool. Like, it's oversized. It's baggy. It's what you can just throw on on those days when you're just chilling at home. Which, let's be honest, <laughs> we're doing more than we want at the minute. Like, it is just an everyday chill at home sort of vibe. So, this is so good. The joggers are just a dream. They're so comfy. They fit the exact same as like, the casual ash joggers. If anybody has those, like, basics from PLT. Last outfit is another neutral one. You will know I had to bring mostly neutrals. So, first of all, this top. This was actually inspired by Eleanor, who I follow on Instagram. I'll put her Instagram handle on screen so she can get full credit. But she had a dress on which was kind of like this with the kind of exposed seams. And I saw it and I was like, honestly, wow. Like, you know when you see a picture and you're like, wow, that needs to be added to my wardrobe. I found a similar thing, a similar vibe on Pretty Little Thing in a top version. I'm slightly confused with this. Like, I don't know if that is the trend. I'm assuming it's not and the seams kind of just gone a bit funny. But yeah, that's not the best. But I'm going to put the top on anyway. One thing I will say to you about this top is size up. 10 is really tight, so I would definitely recommend sizing up in this. I'm going to redo my hair in a second. Sorry, I feel like it's literally... It's literally just falling to pieces, isn't it? But anyway, that's the top. Trousers. We've got another wide leg situation going on. So, these trousers I thought were so cool. They are like jogger material, but they are wide leg, and I thought, that's interesting. They have a tie-up waist like this, and yeah, they're just like long 
flowy wide leg they're like super wide leg i just they were so cool i've been getting into like wide leg loungewear since like summer and i thought maybe i can bring it into like the actual everyday outfits so these are the joggers they're so soft i just love them so i'm gonna pair this outfit together i thought it was really cool again i'll put an overlay on of the joggers so you can see them in their full glory okay this is the top apart from these dangly bits i'm here for this top look i think it's so cute i really like the exposed seam look like i think it's really cool and i thought this outfit looked really good together because the seams are kind of the same color as these trousers so again there'll be a little overlay of the full outfit but honestly absolutely love this like i said this top is tiny like you can see how tight it is so definitely size up if you're like a size 8 slash 10 like me probably size up because it's honestly so tight like my arms feel quite suffocated so i mean i'm probably not going to keep this because it is just a little bit uncomfortable but other than that i think this is really cute the trousers again are just flowy comfy you literally can't feel that you're wearing these which is a win-win if you ask me okay, and now let's move on to the little self-care bits i know pretty little thing with self-care items who knew they literally have like a whole like self-care section it's so fab so first up i got this hair mask this is a dream i've had this a few times in the coconut flavor it's the garnier hair food it's so good i've used this mask for like a couple years now and i know it's so fab but yeah the papaya flavor is so nice i'll open it up hopefully it isn't going to go everywhere it's just like that. I don't know if you can see. It's just basically like a hair mask. So next thing I picked up was these little collagen gel eye patches. Um, these are so good. Like I literally use these all the time. You can get them off quite a lot of websites. These ones are by Skin Academy Collagen Eye Patches. And I feel like these are really good for those mornings where you want to get on with your day. But you're just like eyes are so tired. These are perfect. And I always use these. So yeah, I think you get four in a pack. Yeah. And they're not expensive at all. I definitely recommend those. And then last but not least, on the self-care front, we got a little bath bomb. I mean, who knew Pretty Little Thing had bath bombs? Like, sorry. Wow. This one is a Rainbow River bath ball. I'm going to do a little story, of course, when I put this in the bath. So if you want to see what this looks like, go have a look on Instagram. I've had this haul with me for about a week like, in my house. And I've just been really wanting to use this. But I was like, no, self-control, wait till the haul. You need to show everyone. So yeah, there's that. And then last but not least, we got some pyjamas because I thought to myself, I don't actually have that many like pyjama sets. I just kind of wear like baggy t-shirts, I kind of mix and match, but I thought I need some more actual sets. So I got this, which is just the PLT like oversized top and it just comes with the grey like joggers tight at the bottom, just some classic pyjama bottoms, can't really go wrong. So yeah, I thought that was a really cute pick, a really cute pick, a really cute set. I'll put a picture of the model wearing these on screen because i have already worn them so that is everything i had to show you in today's haul i really really hope you enjoyed it i absolutely love filming hauls i've had a few uploads been missed because of my exams like i said in my last video but i've just missed you all so much absolutely love just filming videos making content talking to you guys so i'm so happy to be back and your favorite piece from the haul down below because i would love to know which was your favorite i feel like mine was probably the brown dress just because i feel like it's so different obsessed with it all and the check trousers i love those as well if you're new here like i said i would love for you to stick around and subscribe i upload every single thursday and sunday and we have hauls we have vlogs we have a couple beauty videos we have girl talk videos i would love for you to stick around there's basically a little bit of something for everyone so definitely stick around and subscribe and also follow me over on instagram i'll kind of put a little thing of it moving up and down on screen here that's where i'll be styling up all these pieces so i'd love for you to come follow me over there but other than that thank you so, so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one Bye.